Harry reportedly doesn't regret anything about his memoir Spare, including the bombshell revelations he made in it. Page 6 learnt the matter from a source who's said to have attended Ellen DeGeneres and Portia de Rossi's surprise wedding vow renewal ceremony late last month. It comes as the royal-born prince went to the event with his wife, Meghan Markle, and reportedly spoke to fellow guests about the matter at hand. The unnamed guest told the publication that the Duke of Sussex shared how really happy he was about the success of the book and the reaction to it. Moreover, it's claimed that the former working royal said he had no regrets about any of the revelations, with the insider adding that he said he's relieved to have got his story out into the world, and that there's been an amazing reaction to it. But while Prince Harry and Meghan Markle allegedly seem to be in extremely good spirits at the event, they're said to have politely avoided questions about their attendance at the coronation of King Charles III. A body language expert seemingly had similar observations about Prince Harry after analysing his behaviour in a new promotional video for a charity project. Speaking on behalf of Betfair Bingo, Darren Stanton is said to have stated that the Duke of Sussex is most definitely in a calm state of mind, adding that this suggests he feels at ease. The expert continued that from the clip featuring the royal-born prince, it doesn't appear that he's phased over the criticism surrounding his book, noting that he's quite clearly looked past the problems. Meanwhile, TV presenter Megyn Kelly slammed the Duke of Sussex for detailing how he lost his virginity to an older woman in the book. Prince William's brother didn't drop the name of the woman, but she's since come forward and identified herself. This is just the latest example in how classless and thoughtless this guy really is, Kelly said on Paul Murray's Sky Australia show. It shows how much better off he was when we didn't know him. The more we get to know him, the less we like him. In fact, it's turning into active disdain. Kelly wasn't impressed, in particular at how Prince Harry claimed he lost his V-card to an older woman, because many thought the woman was so much older than him. However, Sasha Walpole, the woman Prince Harry was referring to, is only 40 years old, two years his senior. What he did to this poor woman, he made it sound like it was a Mrs. Robinson situation where it was like an older woman, like the mother of a friend. No, she was four years older, they were both teenagers, Kelly added. He left the trail of breadcrumbs right to the woman, she accurately saw it coming. She came out and said, alright fine, this is how it happened. But Harry's not a gentleman, Paul, he has no class whatsoever. Google Maps users were stunned to find the spot where Prince Harry lost his virginity marked on the platform as a historical landmark. A prankster managed to fool Google and get the location approved onto the site. People managed to leave some cheeky reviews on the landmark before it was taken down. Putting this on the itinerary for our trip in May, one joker commented, Should we crowdsource a commemorative plaque? Another added. The marker appeared near the historic Vine Tree Inn in Norton, Wiltshire. It even mentions the pub hedge as the location.